Good beautiful morning. Today is Wednesday, June the 15th, and we are going to have an awesome day. standing behind my car. I don't know if you guys can see that, but they're standing right there. It's like two feet from my car, and it's not like there's a whole lot of other cars around. I mean, there's two free spaces on that side. There's a car to my left here, but I don't know. I just, why are you standing there, man? I just started my car. I obviously need to go. Start backing out and see if they move. Thank you, I guess. I'm supposed to shake this. Guess I will to be safe. Don't generally buy coffee-related substances. Uh, I don't know why I bought this, but some sort of frappuccino, mocha of some sorts. So sweet. Looks like the top is a-okay. Okay. Pretty good. Probably not two dollars and seventy cents good, but it's good. Granted, that's not really a fair assessment because I'm not really a coffee fan anyway, so I don't know. Just wanted to be different. So we got one of these Mexican uh what are they called? Mexican bola necklaces? Yeah. Not to be confused with Ebola, I guess. Yeah. But it makes ring it. Okay, that might not work. Uh, the point is, it makes a small little like chime that's supposed to comfort the baby. That way it gets used to it when it's in the womb, so to speak. Not so to speak, I guess that's where it's at. Anyway, uh, so when it starts to like cry and stuff, I guess, when it is birthed. <laughs> I'm really bad at explaining things. Anyway, when it cries, when, it, when it's born and stuff, you can use that sound and it's supposed to comfort it so i don't know stick around for about six months or so and we'll let you know if it works you like being brushed on your side don't you Ugh. he likes it on this side <laughs> doesn't he he wants it on this side something to tell you. I thought of a movie that has a Y to start. Okay. Ear of the Dragon. So then we're back to ends. Back to ends. Sorry, if you're new to my vlog since yesterday, uh, me and Tracy have a continuing game where somebody says the name of a movie and whatever letter it ends with, you have to start a movie with that so we're not allowed to use imdb or anything so it's stretched into where it takes several hours to think of something like that but yeah so i just said a movie that started with a y because that's where we left off and now she's got a movie with an n knights and rodanthe or rodanthe or however you say that knights and rodanthe not ethia rodanthe rodanthe it's oh yeah gotcha gotcha knights so i got an h Getting ready to go into Bob Evans to grab some quick dinner. It's gonna be awesome. Good. What's up, man? Yes, just two. Oh, yes. Thank you, no problem. Good, how are you? Great, thanks for asking. I'll start you guys out, maybe a sweet tea or a Coke. Mm, I'll take a wild berry tea, please. Can I get a sweet tea? 
Thank you all. I get the uh, three cheese burger uh, with fries, no coleslaw. Um, and can I have that with no vegetables? Um, but if I can, can I get the pickles on the side? Rule number one when I eat a hamburger out is I always cut it in half. Just got done eating. It was good. Do you like yours? Definitely super solid. Uh, now headed to Walmart. We're going to pick up some chicken so we can make some crock pot chicken tomorrow. And it's going to be delicious. So I wanted to talk about, I left what I ordered in the video for multiple reasons. One, I can look back and hold myself accountable for what I've ate. And two, to prove a point that I, look, I believe that diet is necessary when it comes to some things. But honestly, I really feel like, and what worked for me when I lost 80 pounds several years ago was calories in versus calories out. If I'm still working out and I'm coming in under my calories, I fully 100% believe that I'm okay. I know there's going to be a lot of people that disagree with that, but you know what? It's my body and I'm going to do things the way that I think I need to do and everybody's different and it's something that worked for me in the past, so it's what I'm going to do now. Hey, what's going on, buddies? Here's a little piece dedicated to my vegetarian friends. Do you need to get a bag to put it in? Yes. Okay. Jesus. Oh my God, I want this rip. Sorry, I hadn't attained my degree in rocket science to pull this bag off the friggin' thing yet. Just hold it a second. Hey, for quality. Here's one. Is that one? Put it in there. Good? Yeah. Boom. Can you put this in the buggy now? Thank you. Generally, anybody, anytime anybody does anything nice for me, I try to say thank you, such as I did with that guy when I was walking out of the door. I don't understand why we as a society stop telling people thank you. It's, it's such an easy thing to do, right? Do you say thanks? Yep. Okay, so check this out. Walmart's got some explaining to do. How was your experience, right? Tell us about your visit today and you could win blah, blah, blah gift cards. No purchase necessary. So you go to the website to complete the survey. It is necessary to have the survey invitation from your Walmart receipt. So how exactly does one participate in this with no purchase if they don't have a receipt? Oh, fix your hair. You don't want to look bad for the world. All 12 people. <laughs> you, you, got, you got something to say? Um, no. Okay. Evie? No. You got anything to say? No. Okay. All right. <laughs> Had to stop at my brother's to get a package. Really, really pumped about this package. It's beneficial in more ways than one. And I'll show you guys that as soon as I get home. So I had to stop at my brother's and the two things that I got... One, uh, well, both I'm super excited about, but check this out. So I first got there, and I was just talking to him about doing videos and stuff, and he gave me a bunch of new t-shirts um, because he said he hates the collar in my shirt when he watches my videos. So uh, definitely a good look from my brother, so to speak. I got, there's like six shirts here. Um... Yeah, there's some more. I mean, they're all brand new shirts. He just picked them up and gave them to me. So, going to have some new t-shirts on, which is going to rock. And here's the other thing I got. I'm super excited about it. Les Mills Combat. This is my favorite beach body routine. Um, I like it a lot. I'm not going to specifically do this program. 
Um, I'm going to do some exercises from it. Like today it's kind of raining and I still got to have to do my workout. I got to do cardio and stuff. Um, and this is going to be perfect for that. Beachbody is getting rid of this for whatever reason. They're not going to carry it anymore. I got this for like $18. Uh, this actually has like two, um, I can't remember what these are called, like some kind of power set. I don't know. Anyway, it's, it's bonus DVDs for the workout. So, I mean, it's still sealed and everything brand new from Beachbody. Uh, my sister-in-law was ordering some stuff, so she just picked that up for me. So super excited about that. Definitely, definitely a super awesome trip to my brothers. All right, guys. I'm actually quite impressed with today. I thought today was going to be a super slow day and that I wouldn't really get a lot filmed for you guys. But I think this is actually the longest vlog that I've produced yet. So hopefully you enjoy it. I hope that it's entertaining. So thank you so much for watching. Again, it means a lot to me. And as always, I will see you guys tomorrow.